Hello and welcome to this Linked POS training video. In this video, we're going to be talking about quick and bulk purchases in Linked POS. To perform a quick purchase, head on over to the Purchases tab. In the drop-down that appears, click on this Inventory button. This will open up the table with a complete list of all the items in your store. To make a quick purchase, choose the item you want to purchase and click on the green plus sign. This will open up the window that allows you to create a quick purchase. Start off by setting the unit price and the unit tax. Next, enter the total purchased quantity. Next, choose the supplier by clicking on these three dots. And finally, click complete. This will open up the payment form. Choose the payment method and enter the payment. Hit complete and this will save your purchase. To make a bulk purchase and link POS, head on over to the purchases menu. In the drop down that appears, click on this purchases button. This will open up the table showing you your complete history of purchases in linked POS. You can search for a particular purchase by setting the criteria and typing in the search bar. To view more details about a purchase, you can double click on it and it will open up in a detailed form. To make a bulk purchase, click on the screen plus sign. This will open up the form that allows you to create a bulk purchase. Start off by choosing the supplier by clicking on these three dots. Next, click on the screen plus sign to start adding items to your purchase order. Linked POS makes it easy for users to choose items with our images button. Clicking on this button will allow you to choose items just by looking at their images. To choose an item, click on the space beside it. When an item is selected, a tick will appear in this space. You can also search for an item by setting the criteria and typing in the search bar. If you want to select all the items in the list, you can do so by clicking on this button. Once done, clicking on this button will add the items to your list. You can also remove an item from your list by clicking on this cross button beside the item. You can set the quantity purchased or other relevant information in these fields. Once done, hit approve and update stock, and this will open up the payment window. Choose the payment method and enter the pay amount, and hit save. This will save your purchase. To view the accounts of a supplier, head on over to the suppliers tab. This will open up the table with all the suppliers you've added in the linked POS. Choose the supplier you want to see details of by double clicking on it. In the window that appears, click on this ledger button. This will open up the window showing you the accounts of the supplier. The credit section shows you how much you owe to the supplier. The debit section shows you how much the supplier owes to you. We hope you find this video helpful. If you have any questions, leave them down in the comment section below.